and I'm going the greatest basketball player to ever play the game six foot six from North Carolina Michael Jeffrey Jordan said that I did not shoot enough he said I was passive and what better way to prove Michael Jordan wrong by showing out tonight coach wants me to get 30 points I got that in me What's good everybody? I'm back again with another video. And guys, I don't know if the Clippers got the memo or what. They knew I was coming out more aggressive tonight. As next thing you know, I see triple teams all game. I get this steal and I get the flush right here with the left hand. And I'm coming up like, ah, I think I broke my wrist. You know how you pull that muscle in your arm when you go up for a dunk? A lot of people don't know about that, but when you are a dunker, when you first start dunking, you have a little muscle in your arm and in your forearm that you start messing up, that you got to strengthen up. But right here, I see Gerald Wallace, and I know better, because Jordan said I passed too much. I'm not passing him that ball. I'm going up for the flush. That arm seems just good enough to get that flush. As I come down once again, I get the pull-up jumper. Nothing is on my mind. I don't even care about the Kia sponsorship right now. I don't care about winning. I care about getting these buckets and helping myself with the media and getting them off my back. This is not the first time the media has been on my back. And with Jordan saying something to me now, I know I have to play better. I'm pushing it up the court with the LeBron coast to coast. I get this double screen. I drive in and I get the layup. Get up off the floor, Blake. Stop flopping. Before David Stern decides to find you. And now I get the oh no on the play. I'm calling for it. Pushing it up. LeBron, coast to coast, activating. No one stops me. And I get another flush. And I'm swagging back down the court once again. That would help out a lot. You know, if you quit dunking with your left hand and dunk with your right one, you feel a lot better. So now we get the block once again. I'm running, filling my lane. And you know I want to call for it. I get it. I drive in once again. And I'm headed to the line with the hoop and the harm, and I'm straight flexing on him right there. Going up simple right over CP3. He's just too small. The help is not there in time. And now Chris Paul has it. I'm guarding him on the wing. He finds Andre Blatch. He misses. I snag the rebound, and I'm pushing it up the court once again. I want Chris Humphrey to set me a screen. I drive in, and that's just another big boy basket over a smaller defender. You can't stop me like that. You got to double team me. You got to triple team me. And now I'm driving in once again, and another flush. Like CP3 should not be your help side defender. You might want to get somebody else. As we get another, oh no, and we're pushing it up the court once again. I'm calling for it. I get this bucket. I achieve the goal that Michael Jordan and the coach have set out. I get the flush and that fat head on Jared Dudley. So now I got 31 points, and I'm trying to get that win now. But, of course, that win is not going to be easy here in the Staples Center as I drive the lane once again. Jared Dudley, did you not learn your lesson the last time? Another Fathead back-to-back -back posters. Make sure you go to fathead.com and pick those up. Add them to your wall. Now, Chris Paul kicks it out to Jamal Crawford. If you don't remember, Jamal Crawford lit me up in the fourth quarter the last time. And that was just a couple of videos ago. So I'm coming right back at him again, hitting him with the spin cycle with no fabric softener. And I get the bucket to go. But of course, Jamal Crawford is deadly. He comes right back, crosses me up, and goes up with the left hand to give them a one-point lead. And it's now it's a three-point lead. I go back to Jamal Crawford. DC's not even covering his man, and CP3 delivers the dagger. We end up losing this game. Y'all be good. I'll have another video out real soon, and hopefully I proved Michael Jordan wrong. And check out the cutscenes. What would you do? Apparently being called out by an NBA legend on social media is a pretty big motivator for you, as you really stepped up your game tonight. Care to make any comments about that situation? Yeah, I saw what was said, and I'd be lying if I didn't say it factored into my play a bit. It's hard not to listen when an NBA legend has something to say, and I'm not afraid to admit when my game may have a weakness I need to work on. Hopefully, tonight's game was a good indication of the way I'll be able to play moving forward.
decisions in this game are crazy, man. Yo, check it out. What's up, dude? <laughs> hey, look, I know you've been getting by on all those local deals, uh -huh. but I think we finally hit the big time. What? What's up? What's the deal, man? Hey, man, I've been talking to Sprint for a while now. They love you as a player. They want to feature you in one of their campaign ads. Nice. So what I got to do to make it happen, man? <laughs> Nothing, man. I just got to call them and let them know you're in. All right. So what are you waiting for, dude? Make the call. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Hold on for a minute, all right? There's more. I've also been talking to Sprite. They like you too. Yeah, I think there's an opportunity for an even bigger deal there if I can get it done. Wow, man. This is awesome, dude. Two big deals like this on one day, man, it's unreal, man. No, not exactly. You're going to have to choose one or the other. I mean, if either company's going to be putting your face out there, they're going to want an exclusive window with you. Exclusive window. Yeah, it's up to you, man. You want me to call up Sprint right now, or should we pass and work on a bigger deal with Sprint? I'm with you either way. Man, if you already got Sprint in the bag, I say let's do it, bro. Sprite's cool and all, but at this point in my career, I'm all about the sure thing, you feel me? Yeah, man, I hear you. I'll get it done, man. Congrats. Thanks, bro. Your first big deal. <laughs> yeah. So what's up? Want to hit some 2K real quick since you're here? Man, it's on. Let's do it, bro. Yo, you got to see my my player, man. This dude is crazy. Man, we'll see, man. We'll see how dope he is. 